Welcome back, everybody. Thank you, Polly. Now, police have appealed to the public for help after launching their murder investigation following the disappearance of 19-year-old Leah Croucher in 2019. Human remains were found at a house less than half a mile from where she was last seen around Milton Keynes, and forensics experts are now scouring the property. Thames Valley Police have acknowledged that the house was not searched in their initial investigation back in 2019. We can cross now to Milton Keynes live and speak to GB News reporter Jack Carson, who is outside the property. Jack, thank you very much. What's the latest, please? So, the latest we've heard an hour ago um, from the Thames Valley Police, who said in a statement that a Home Office post-mortem examination is expected to take place on Friday, so that's tomorrow, although this may take some time, as will the formal identification of the deceased person located inside the property. Of course, police uh, were tipped off by a member of the public about this property on Monday. They've been here since then, where they discovered uh, the rucksack and other personal possessions of Leah Croucher here and also, as well as you mentioned, human, mora- human remains. She was 19 when she went missing on the 15th of February in 2019 here in Milton Keynes. And that sparked a three and a half year long search with police, you know, reviewing 1,200 hours of CCTV footage, going uh, door to door of over 4,000 home inquiries as well. But it was only on Monday when they were alerted to this property here. Now, they, uh, now Leah Croucher was, uh, was walking to work at 8.15 a.m. on the 15th of February when she vanished um, on Buzzacott Lane. In that location, in this location, is only about half a mile away. So residents and neighbours here are, are shocked at, at the, the distance and how close that her final uh, place that she was seen and actually where um, her possessions have been found here, how close that is. I'm not sure if you can see behind me, but people and people and neighbours have been coming today to lay floral tributes here um, and pay their respects. Um, one of them uh, saying that, Leah, you were never forgotten and we never gave up. Another th- saying, time for your parents to take you home. Now, it's worth noting that statement that no human remains have officially formally been identified uh, to anybody uh, just yet. Ian Stewart, the MP for Milton Keynes South, has also said that it was extremely upsetting to learn of the developments in the search for Leah and he added I'm in contact with Thames Valley Police about the situation and will help them in any way I can. My thoughts and prayers continue to be with Leah's loved ones about this difficult time. Leah's family continue to be kept informed and updated by the police.